Hi guys, um, I want to say before we start the video, um, I'm sorry for not making another gaming video, um, it's just, Bandicam and I are not getting along right now, and video games and I are not getting along right now, like I was trying to play Minecraft today, and Jurassic World Evolution, and Fortnite today, and none of it worked. None of it worked. It all just... I'll, I'll fix it at some point, but... It did not work. So do expect those inside of the future once I get those to work again. But I'm sorry for not being inside the thing that I said inside the updates video where I was like... Real life. Nothing. Video game. Nothing. Real life. I think that I'm going to alter that a little bit to just two videos per month. And that's it, just so that then I can, you know, have a bit of relaxing time. <laughs> Alright, let's start with the video now. Uh, what's the best, what's the best Super Smash Bros. game for the Nintendo Switch? <laughs> show you the intro for it. Don't get mad. <laughs> All right. My first Kirby game um, that I actually sat down and played, you know, was Kirby Fighters Deluxe. Um, it was good. It was a good Kirby game. Uh, and then, like one day, they just announced, hey, Kirby Fighters 2. And I was like, alright. How much does it cost? And it's like 20 bucks. And I'm like, what? <laughs> $20 for basic Super Smash Brothers? And they were like, yep. Yep. Um, so yeah, I'm mad at them. <laughs> um, because if you don't, uh, also, I, I already had Super Smash Brothers Ultimate. Whenever I recorded those videos where I played Super Smash Brothers Ultimate, um, they didn't even announce Super Smash, but not, they didn't even announce Kirby Fighters 2 yet. But Kirby Fighters 2 and Smash Ultimate are about the same game. So that one's Kirby characters and one's 78 characters or whatever, 80 something characters. There's a lot of characters in Smash Ultimate. And I'm not saying that Smash Ultimate's a bad game. That's a great game. I have a poster here and a poster here. For Smash Ultimate, um, because GameStop was just handing them out. <laughs> um, so yeah, but inside the game, um, you fight Kirby against Kirby, um, and that's just the main part of the game. There's also other parts of the game, like there's a um, quote unquote, so say Samus area is actually called story mode, which is basically what so say Samus area is. Um, like it's at Brawl, very similar to that, except that it's a Kirby story, so it's just much darker, um, and longer because Kirby lore is it's a lot, it's a lot of stuff. Um, and also there's classic mode. This one's actually called single-handed mode. Whenever they announced single-handed mode, I was like, ah, oh, yeah, you can play with one hand. Nope. <laughs> you had to play with two. Um, I don't know if that's what they were originally going for or something, but, or maybe it's like, oh, I took them down single-handed. No. Uh, it just, it's just classic mode. 
again. And Kirby Fighters Deluxe, um, that was the big thing inside of the inside of the game. Was oh you can play classic mode over and over and over again. Um, yeah. So this has been me um, ranting about <laughs> Kirby Fighters 2 being well, okay. The real reason why is because if you want Super Smash Brothers for cheap, this is only twenty dollars. Smash Brothers sixty plus Smash Brothers has sixty bucks of DLC, not including Mii Fighters, um, and also not including Piranha Plant. Um, but Piranha Plant was free, so. Um, so yeah. Bye. Thank you.